The Washington Wizards started off 0-8 last year and are 0-5 thus far this season. However, a bright spot for those Wizards. They've won five straight against Charlotte. There's Bradley Beal, the number three pick in the draft for the Wizards. The number two pick in the draft, Michael Kidd Gilchrist playing for Charlotte, and he's playing well. This is Trevor Ariza in the corner with a three. He was two of eight from distance in Washington in front, 24-17. Then Trevor Booker finds Ariza for the lay-in. Ariza scored a dozen in the first quarter, and Washington was up by five. Second quarter now, Ramon Sessions has been playing terrific ball in Charlotte. Nice little layup there to beat the shot clock buzzer. He was seven of 18 from the field. Later, Michael Kidd Gilchrist to the rack, landed in 15 points and eight rebounds. Later, it's Gilchrist hitting the jumper, but he appears to hurt himself on the play. He would leave the game for the remainder of the first half, but the good news, he came back in the second half. Kemba Walker knocking down a jump shot. Charlotte goes up 50-39 to on the Wizards. Can the Bobcats win again? Into the third quarter we go. Bradley Beal open for three, but that's no good. He was just one of 11 from the field. Bradley Beal also had a turnover in the game. There it is, traveling on that play, and that gave Charlotte some opportunities to extend that lead. Ramon Sessions again, nice little spin move inside for the lap. He had a game-high 21 points. Bobcats up 66-48. Later, it's Kemba Walker. Tough shot, tough hanging shot there. 76-67, a little tighter though. Kemba Walker this time takes the basket for the lay-in. That's good on one end for the Bobcats. On the other end, this is good as well. Cartier Martin rejected by Tyrus Thomas, hustling down the court and getting back on defense. Charlotte up by 16 later. Sessions outside for three from the wing. And the Bobcats improve to 3-3 three and three on the young season. They take down the Wizards by the final score of 92-76. to 76.